User chord mode allows you to store chords onto your pads from the keys for easy playback. To get into user chord mode, press shift and then use a chord. Whilst in user chord mode, your keybed will always output chord detection. Watch how the screen feedback changes while I change chords. If you're ever unsure of what chord you're playing at any time, head to this mode and look at your launch key screen. This is a great tool to help you learn some music theory. And if you want to turn chord detection off, press the scene launch button. I'm going to create a B section to add variation to my track. A B section is a different part of the song that changes things up from the main part. To create the foundation for my B section, I'm going to copy and paste just my drums and bass. You can do this by pressing copy on your chosen clip and pasting it to the second scene, which will be your B section. To add the variation, I'm going to use the same drum pattern, but without the hi-hats. It'll sound something like this. I'm going to take advantage of user chord mode by finding some chords that go with my song to store onto the pads. Let's find some chords. Now let's store them onto the pads. To store a chord onto a pad, hold the pad and then play your desired chord. I'm going to store the following chords onto the pads. Now I've made a mistake with this one and hit the wrong notes into pad 4. To delete this, hold function and press the pad you made the mistake on. I'll store the correct chord into it now. I can play all of my chords really easily on the pads now. Now let's record. Make sure only your chosen track is record armed. Press record on your launch key. Listen out for the eight clicks and then start playing your chords. To finish the recording, press stop on your launch key. Now I didn't hit the stop button soon enough, so my chords aren't going to loop correctly when I press play. To fix this, just open the clip you've just recorded and drag the loop brace back to the end of the pattern. This will then loop it correctly. I'm also going to quantize what I've recorded. Quantizing aligns your notes to the grid, making sure everything sounds in time. Just press the quantize button on your launch key.